okay hey pisces welcome back to another reading it's queen to say as you all may know if you don't know now you know welcome to the channel i'm glad to have you if you're a new watcher new subscriber things of that nature i'm sorry y'all they this is literally like my reality as soon as i start recording people get to talking and doing all the whole extra stuff okay um that could be significant to y'all okay People trying to, um, I don't know, talk louder than you while you're speaking, trying to cut you off, things of that nature, okay? I just had to say that for some reason. All right, but let's get into the energy for this week or this upcoming month because this is y'all season, okay? So first things first, all right, what I wrote down is that for some of y'all, I feel like um, y'all could be cutting out a lot of things that you normally do, like the internet, okay? Um, not talking to people as much. Um, getting back into like things that you used to do as a kid or different um, hobbies to keep you busy. Or, I don't know. I feel like the things that you have been participating in, they no longer fill that void. Okay. So I feel like you've been searching for new hobbies, um, possibly new friends or just different places to go sightsee, things of that nature. Um, also feel like for some of y'all, y'all have been practicing and digging into spirituality okay things like the occult okay um healing with herbs all right for some of y'all spells as well um not everybody okay but just learning about like the supernatural realm the spiritual realm things of that nature okay and um if people know y'all do this they could be thinking that um you are causing things to not go their way all right but you got the will of fortune here and i feel like it's because they try to put something on you and something is being protected okay um i mean you're being protected by something i don't know if y'all did some type of protection work or this is your spirit guides um protecting you watching out for you um in the background things you don't see okay but there's somebody definitely gossiping all right they could be saying you're too busy you're not focused on um them like i said uh putting it redirecting your energy towards yourself and the things that you love to do your kids um just your home life in general um yeah they could be saying you're uh selfish you only care about luxury things all right little miss perfect is what i'm hearing all right um what else do i have for you guys i also feel like for this um year for y'all birthday um y'all won't like big uh like grown people gifts okay with that share your gifts card like you want something that's useful, okay? Like an air fryer or like, I don't know, an oil change. Like some a grown person's gift, okay? Y'all don't really want no clothes, no nothing. Y'all want some some type of land, some type of LLC, something um that doesn't go down as soon as you buy it, okay? Um, I feel like there's also um somebody obsessed with your energy okay with obsession and fixation all right we got the snake here as well okay so some of y'all feel like some of y'all could possibly work in the medical field medical aid or something like that because you know the snake is on like the uh health health care symbol okay but if this is not that like i said there's somebody who is mad because something didn't go that way something didn't work out some type of i don't know if this was just negative energy they actually put did a spell or something of that nature okay it just something didn't work out somebody's obsessed with um what you have and what you can acquire all right and in turn they're actually obsessed with that luxurious lifestyle while you're just you know doing what you have to do and it's just coming to you you're not chasing it all right Somebody's mad that the, the more they chase something, the, I don't know, I'm hearing like the more they chase something, the faster you get it. Like if they're plotting on your downfall and they don't understand why, all right? We also got the Chiron here and the Saturn here, okay? the um It's a, a full moon coming up March 6th, if I'm not mistaken. I don't remember what sign it's for, but definitely it's coming up, all right? So y'all could be definitely feeling a little bit emotional right now all right maybe having some blockages or some, like self-doubt i don't know and this is this is why you're um redirecting your energy cleansing your energy um walking in your divineness okay you call, like i said i feel like y'all have been doing something spiritual okay realizing you got some type of self-heal superpower or something like that okay 
all right but definitely with the full moon here you're going to be like emotional so just allow those feelings to pass um at this time because you are dealing with saturn and pisces okay saturn just moved to pisces if i'm not mistaken okay so a lot of a lot of discipline all right a lot of structure a lot of tests a lot of things going on all right a lot of um time for learning um at this time all right with the moon card and the saturn card being here all right some type of cycle coming um back around again and I feel like with the moon card being here, you have to uh, be able to emotionally handle something, be emotionally mature, especially with Daddy Saturn here, okay? So something is coming around, all right? I feel like it's important for you to react emotionally different to something, all right? Because I feel like it's just like a reoccurring theme or something, okay? So let's get into the energy. I've been talking for a long time. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Like I said, stalking on social media. Okay. I'm not lying. I feel like somebody is obsessed with what you got. Just want to see what you got going on. Things of that nature. Okay. You got you bring me happiness here. Okay. So this could be like the people that you do have around you. The people who you are giving your energy to. Okay. Brightening up the room. All right, being bubbly, jolly, things of that nature. All right, for some of y'all, we got the hitman knows you. So somebody could have possibly tried to take something from you. Okay, but they knew you as well. That's why I said something backfired or something didn't go as planned with something. Okay, let me take a sip of my coffee. All right, let's see. You got open sesame here okay so i feel like you you feel a, a certain blockage coming up off of you at this time okay i feel like you you know it's like a new season um i feel like you feel the inner energetic shift all right and you know it's time for you to take action i also feel like a lot of y'all could have a lot of fire in your chart aries leo sag heavy on the aries all right yeah, we definitely got some candle magic here, okay? This could be you or them, but I, I was picking up on that energy um, already, okay? Yeah, we got two people. So two people could be doing candle magic on you or a part of uh, trying to um, bring you to some type of downfall or have, make you have some type of loss, okay? We got heated discussion here, so this could possibly um, show up this month here okay some of you guys um like i said you guys do want to um be in a spiritual spiritual work um being a healer okay having like, your personal herbs things of that nature y'all don't really deal with maybe that's why that snake was there y'all don't really deal with like hospitals and um treatment from doctors i feel like y'all try to go the uh, natural rate about it if you can okay but definitely something going on with your healing abilities Okay, you have some type of skill, some type of spiritual skill, spiritual knowledge, all right? You know a lot about the spiritual realm. Okay, let's see what else is going on here, all right? Yeah, we got coloring book here, so there could possibly be somebody trying to paint a situation um, differently than what is actually going on, okay? Trying to make something seem as as if it is not all right we got adhd here okay this person could have this all right or this is you just um like i said that fire energy going here going there doing this trying to like i said redirect your energy can't sit still okay yeah I th it says sanity here okay this person could be possibly losing their sanity or this is you trying to stay sane okay you know somebody is doing something in the shadows for some of y'all but i don't feel like you can quite prove it for some of y'all okay or if this is not that this just stands for you like i said you doing different hobbies all right redirecting your energy in order to stay sane in order to get you out the past in order to bring a new spark into your life okay yeah, we got cock blocking here. I definitely said somebody could potentially trying to block something for you, cause some type of bump in the road, fork in the road, all right? Something, somebody's trying to do something in order for you, for it to not go your way. Um, but this is like very low key. 
I feel like it's somebody who you would never imagine, if that makes sense. Okay, we got am I a bad person here, okay? So since, like, you know, you redirecting your energy, you putting your energy where it's deserved and not needed, all right? You could possibly, um, you know, asking yourself, are you a bad person? Or your intuition is giving you some type of tip about somebody or something. And you could be feeling guilty because it's like, you don't really have the proof or something like that. Or I don't know. I just feel like right now, um, y'all could be possibly ducked off, like I said, doing something, working on some type of project, neglecting certain people, certain things, all right? Some people deserve it. Others, you know, not so much, but you can't be everywhere at once, okay? Let's just get one more. Well, two came out, okay? Yeah, we got Aquarius here, so... Aquarius could be significant. You could have Aquarius moon, sun. It says put something in your food here. So it says time has found them apart until they meet once again. Okay. So somebody may be coming back around the corner. Um, that you also could be at distance from somebody. Okay. All right. Let's get some advice for this week for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. What advice do you have for the Pisces this week? Ah. Okay, so we have Adventures Away. So definitely, um, I don't know, for some of y'all, I feel like y'all could be traveling for your birthday. Um, going somewhere where it's hot and colorful. All right, whether this even be, I don't know, 30 minutes away or something, um, getting a new change of scenery, okay? Um, definitely see you packing up some luggage or going somewhere for your birthday. Um, it says, break up your routine and live a little. It's time to take, it's time for some adventure, plan a vacation, take a spontaneous drive. A change of pace and scenery will do you good. Plus, you never know who you meet or what you experience along the way. A fabulous new friend or partner, a spectacular meal at a charming local joint, the vista of a lifetime. Um, with this energy, I feel like some of y'all definitely um, have been working on some projects because we got teamwork here. So wherever you go or plan to go for your birthday, there could be a potential um, conversation that could lead to like um, work, business, things of that nature. Y'all teaming up and collaborating on a specific goal. Okay, let's get one more card. Okay, this one says wishes fulfilled. Okay, that's that open sesame, that blockage being lifted. Okay, a tired turning in your finances um, and your emotions. All right. It says your wishes have been germinating there deeply, planted in the soul of, of the loving universe. And fulfillment is here or just around the corner. But faith is required. When we put ourselves out there, it's easy to get deflated if what we want doesn't materialize right away. Have confidence. You are more capable of manifesting your deepest desires. It is all happening, okay? So for this card, definitely um, y'all have some type of spiritual help in the background, helping these things that you want um, come down into fruition for you, okay? Keeping you sane, keeping you motivated, all right? Keep you... Um, learning these cycles, all right, keep you transitioning and just keeping you open to receiving new blessings, new experiences, you know, new partners, ideas, things of that nature, okay? So let's get into the tarot. Let's see what is going on for you guys this month, this week, next few days, okay? Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Let me see what these is. I ain't going to take them, though. Okay, for some of y'all, somebody could possibly trying to take you to the court, okay, or file something against you, um, claiming you took something from somebody, lost something, okay? Something about some money. Somebody's definitely facing judgment. Okay, this could be this person who, like I said, is sending something your way, upset because you got the will of fortune here. Something is going your way. They tried to get something of material from you. Okay, and it, it backfired with the magician in reverse. Okay, 
They don't have the power that you hold. They don't do something the way you do. They don't have the credit. They don't even have the, I don't know, something. Like I said, they don't have a spiritual team behind them, okay? This could possibly be somebody who's like, has a lot of evil intentions, okay? All right, let's see. This could be somebody's mother or a woman, woman figure. All right, what's going on with Pisces this week? What's the main things for Pisces this week? Exactly, Six of Pentacles coming out in reverse, okay? Somebody trying to take advantage or take something from you, put you in some type of debt, okay? Like, what the fuck, Pisces? That's weird as hell. Or I don't know if this is like, y'all going somewhere, make sure y'all... um. They not double charging your card, overcharging your card, or getting your card numbers for some of y'all. Okay, you might notice something. Um, I don't know. Just pay attention to your finances, your cards, things of that nature for some of y'all. I don't know why that's coming out, but I feel like it needs to be said here. Okay, why is the Eight of Cups here? Like y'all dealing with some type of scheme and scamming, fraud, fraudulent something, okay? Like I said, y'all moving with this eight of cups here and the five of wands in reverse, okay? Y'all are moving, redirecting y'all energy from these toxic, negative people. People who only want to take advantage of you, get what you got. I don't know, see you fail in some type of way or feel like they have one up on you. They're doing better than you, okay? You're no longer finna be arguing, fighting, giving them any any type of energy okay they beefing with they self is really what's going on here okay and they like i said they feel like you're doing something but that's just karma coming back to bite somebody in the ass okay most definitely they could be i don't know what's going on here here go king of pentacles and the hangman yeah it's pisces pisarian energy okay you're having some type of abundance some type of like I said, you're getting something, you're working on something, you have something of material value. That's something that everybody wants. Whether this be a relationship, whether this be a car, a house, I don't know. Like I said, your mental stability, being able to stay sane, or that spiritual protection that you have. Somebody wants what you have. Hell, that's very, very, very weird. I could communicate very, very, very well. I'm sorry, I just had to. What's this Six of Pentacles in reverse? We got the Three of Wands, okay? Um, somebody thinks that something's going to go their way with this Three of Pentacles here. They think they're going to get away with um, being able to take advantage of you, putting you in some type of debt, making you lose something. They're very persistent on it. No matter how many times something don't go their way, how many times they get caught in their tracks, okay? How many times they just fail altogether? Um, they're gonna somebody's gonna keep doing this, okay? Somebody is very manipulative here with the king of swords in reverse. Could like to play mind games, okay? Something psychological. Somebody could also study psychology. Okay, what's this two of pentacles yeah like i don't know i feel like somebody pretends like i don't know they want to be you maybe they could wear what you wear do what you do okay they i feel like some people impersonate you like in the mirror or something when nobody's looking like this is so fucking weird okay why are the two of pentacles here i feel like this month pisces y'all are going to be very busy so you're not even going to notice this person. Um, you got the Nine of Cups here. Going back to that card that I said, which is fulfilled earlier, okay? And the Six of Wands here, okay? Um, like I said, you being, like, missing in action, okay? Doing what you got to do right now. People going to feel like, you know, um, you don't have something or, I don't know, you lost some type of credibility or somebody thinks whatever they're getting away with, or trying to plan for you, stop for you, something like that. Um, they think they have this in the bag, but the truth is the six of wands is in reverse, okay? Nobody even nobody's gonna pay attention to this person, all right. 
okay with the nine of cups here okay you're gonna be too busy to even notice what somebody um has going on this could be an aries here this could be somebody um at your job somebody who you used to be friends with okay Yeah, you're not even going to notice something. You're going to be too busy focused on your work, some type of entrepreneur. Um, I don't know. Just very, very busy this week. But definitely pay attention to your intuition this month. Or if you've been feeling, um, yeah, you got the judgment card here, okay? If you've been feeling some type of way, okay, go with your gut. Okay, somebody definitely trying to assassinate your character. This could be a defamation of character. I, I did pick up like some type of court or something. Y'all going to court or some something with the law. Okay. Um, what other messages do you have here for Pisces? Uh, no, that's the Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so we got a lot of Pentacles here. King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, and the Knave of Pentacles, okay? Um, definitely collabing with somebody. Like I said, y'all could have a, a partner that financially spoils you. If not, you take on both roles, that, that male, that female role, okay? Like I said, y'all have a lot of assets. Y'all have a lot of values, okay? You know how to tend to your money. You have good relationships with your money. I'm sorry, I'm looking at the Queen of Pentacles. Y'all have good relationships with your money. Okay, and I feel like y'all balancing out y'all feminine and masculine energy for the males and the females, okay? Um, I definitely feel like you stepping away, you being missing in action and focusing on your work, on your projects, whatever you're collabing here with somebody um, is definitely going to put you on a new path with this page of pentacles um, coming out here, okay? It's a lot of different routes you could take with something, okay? Um, whatever you're doing as well is going to lead you to a, a lot of different, I don't know, different paths, persons, connect you to something, um, different, okay? And whoever this is that said that you left them out in the cold, okay, um, they're going to be in stuck, they're going to be stuck in stagnation, okay? Something's not going to go their way, just period, operating, somebody's just operating out of, um, the darkness, Okay, and that never goes your way. All right, Pisces. So I feel like this this month, y'all definitely going to be getting a lot of um, money coming in. You got the Two of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, as well as the Queen of Pentacles here. So a lot of Pentacles coming in, a lot of stacking y'all money, seeing a lot of results. Okay, and dealing with um, people upset um, at the rate you're going, what you're attaining. Okay, so... Just be aware of that. Try not to um, indulge too much with the Saturn card here because Pisces is going to be, Saturn is going to be in Pisces, okay? So a lot of tests are going to be um, coming out. You're going to have to mature a lot, okay? Um, and have some self-control because these people are going to try you most definitely. You're going to be upset about how you're getting something or what you're getting, okay? So that is all that I have for you guys today. If this resonated in any way, shape, or form, be sure to hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching.